Welcome to Module 13, Lesson 3. Our I can statement is, I can measure an angle as it relates to the fractional part of a circle. So we're going to build on what we were working on in the last lesson with a unit angle and understand how that relates to a fractional part of the circle. Right, we're going to go straight to problem number two. In planning an abstract painting, Penn draws a circle and uses fractional pieces to make angles in the circle. What is the fractional measure of the shaded angle? How can we find the number of angles that come together in the center of the circle? Well, what do we need to do with our unit angles to find how many there are? We can count them, right? So we can count to find there are eight angles. Okay, so we know that this circle is made of eight angles. So if we're thinking about a fractional measure, we need to know what each of these pieces is as a fraction of the circle. If there's eight angles, that means there's eight pieces. So we're gonna go ahead and label each of our pieces as an eighth. I'm gonna start here at that first shaded one and go around clockwise and label the eighths of my circle. All right, so then we should be able to say what fraction of the circle is shaded green? Three-eighths of the fraction is shaded green. Okay, let's go ahead and complete the check understanding. What is the fractional measure of the shaded angle? Okay, so we're given a couple of different circles here. This first one is broken apart into how many unit angles? There are five unit angles here, so we know we're working in fifths. Here's one fifth, two fifths. Okay, and then go ahead and fill in what is the fractional measure of the shaded angle. That fractional measure is three fifths. Right, so then let's go ahead and complete the next one. Do we have any unit angles here? So we only have our one, right? So what is the fractional measure? It's one whole. Joyce cut a strawberry pie into 10 equal slices. She shares seven slices with her family. What is the fractional measure of the angle of the pie that is left? Well, we know that there are 10 unit angles here. So each of these pieces is one tenth. So the fractional measure of the angle of the pie that is left is three tenths. 